This is my first all-star work game. We escaped our 15-hour practice to go to Starbucks. Um, I need a triple shot of everything. Everything. So, oh my gosh, I was selected to host at NBA All-Star Weekend with the NBA, so follow the journey. Good morning. I always think how early is too early when it comes to getting to the airport, and then something will happen, and I'm so glad that I am too early. I'm vlogging and you're vlogging. We're vlogging We are vlog. vlogging together. Go follow her channel, and then you, you go follow my channel. Oh my gosh, like, oh my gosh. Brit, we're going to All-Star. This is crazy. This is amazing. Here we go, we are taking off, headed to Chicago. First stop will be Starbucks, second stop will be hotel, then we will be going straight to work for an introduction and a tour. This is so surreal. I'm in the city of my favorite rapper, Kanye West, hosting the NBA All-Star Games. Like, this is wild. After work, first night, we drink box wine in the hotel. Hi, Instagram from Chicago. Drinking a nice grapefruit beer to end the night. DJ Heat's first box wine. She doesn't know how to slap the bag. <laughs> All right, what's on the breakfast menu today, Jess? Um, okay, we got a little bit of donut with some love on top, and then a nice pink smoothie to complement it. We're all about aesthetic around here. All right, cool. Um, yeah. Yeah, so. very festive. Thanks. Me, I'm getting fuel, <laughs> vitamin C. Shout out to Emergency. Mm. We're not uh -huh. my uh, deal. Hashtag sponsored. Hashtag sponsored, hashtag <laughs> ad. <laughs> yeah. Going over here, Heat, what is from the breakfast for you? Listen here, because the devil is alive when you're here today. <laughs> I am a sanctified Christian. I will not touch that devil food or that devil food's cake. <laughs> what you mean? I got bananas. Jesus ate carbs. I got Jesus ate carbs and then look what they did to him. <laughs> Amen. Alkaline water. About on to Miss Hannah. What, what's on the menu today? I'm full of sin. Mm. <laughs> Day two, and I shouldn't have ate that sugar. But look at this court. Oh my God. Hi. Hi. Oh, you're blocked. It's snowing. Hello, Chicago. Their flag kind of looks like DC's flag, just a little. All star reality. Um, Hi. It's hard to vlog because we've been kind of working. We're tired. All day and night, we're sleepy. Working, working day and night. You got me working, working day and night. Oh. Wait, are they going to give us copyright if we start singing? No, because we have anyway. all to. <laughs> um, so yes, we've been working day and night. Literally. The only Instagram picture that Heat had is when I snuck of her while she working. was working on the floor. I gotta get a picture of you working, my bad, bro. <laughs> it's okay, I looked rough today. <laughs> Probably look rougher tomorrow. So for everyone that thinks, what do all stars do when they get off of work? Sleep. Sleep. Right now we're going to Starbucks, my favorite place in the world. She's Amen. Going to Starbucks. Amen. Everyone videoing the deep dish. The amount of papers and scribbles right here. This is what anxiety looks like. You ready to continue this 12 hour day? It's a 15 hour day. 15 hour day. 15 hour day. Uh, 15 hour day. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. We have two hours to show. We escaped our 15 hour practice to go to Starbucks. Um, I need a triple shot of everything. Everything. That's Chicago's That's snow. Like, I need a triple shot of caffeine Ooh. and the good stuff. Yes, yes. We're going to do that. <laughs> And then try to warm up. Goodbye. Adios. Ciao. Au revoir. 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 You say goodbye in French is au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. My God. Au revoir. Just getting 
getting back in from the final like full rehearsal day game 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 day well first game day is tomorrow and it's almost 11 o'clock at night and I am finally excited like I'm so exhausted and I'm only gonna get just a baby hours of sleep but I'm finally getting to where it's it's fun and not as scary so I'm excited um, tomorrow I'm hosting the rising stars media day and it's gonna stream on NBA Facebook and Twitch and YouTube so my mom gets to see a little bit of that and I'm excited but I literally can't keep my eyes open all the way if you can't see the like, dark spots in my eyes I'm just like so exhausted and I now have a new respect for artists that tour and say that wow I went to a city for a week and I didn't see it because I really haven't seen much of Chicago. We've been in the arena and anytime I get exhausted, I just look around and I'm like, this is real, this is surreal. Like this is NBA All-Star and I am hosting and I'm in charge of entertaining all these people. It's like super cool, super surreal. And the people that I work with so far are amazing and talented and it's just so much I can learn from them and they can learn from me too. So it's just such a vibe. Good morning, rise and shine. <laughs> I just finished most of my makeup and headed to my first event. Well, headed to the arena where my first event will be. And I'm actually feeling pretty good. Hello basketball fans and welcome to Rising Stars Media Day here in Chicago during NBA All-Star 2020. I'm so excited to be here. Hello, bonjour, konnichiwa, and hola from around the world as you tune in to our exclusive coverage. I am your host, Britt Waters, from the Washington Wizards, if you can't tell. And I am so excited to show off all of the rising stars. I gotta say, worst part about Chicago was this weather. So cold. And if you didn't realize it, NBA All-Star is at like three different arenas. So, I found my outfit number two. About to host the Special Olympics Unified Game. And I'm excited. So So, I made this jacket. I'm really proud of it. Realizing my Chicago vlog is almost like 90% in this hotel room. That's sad. Um, also, now that it's like actually All-Star Weekend, like it's Friday, I've been here since Tuesday, the traffic is crazy. Thank you so much, man. You can go right here with Bam Fire. I'm Lowry. You guys have been being asked about basketball all the time. We're gonna give you some fun and rapid fire questions to get to know you better. Are you ready to go for a stop? Basketball national team. Now, practice is a point which you are getting ready for the 2020 Olympics in Tokyo. How big is the pressure on that? You know, I think it's expectation kind of, you know, setting a standard. We're really excited to be here and make the all-star and have a chance to practice in front of everyone. Real bean? Yes, the one. Why it looks so little in real life? Is it a, I gotta say a bean or a bean. beam? Bean. Bean. It looks like a lima. Like Wait. a lima, like pork yeah. and beans. Wait, yeah. why is it so, on Instagram, it looks so big. Look how big it is right now. Are you kidding? Are you for real, for real? It's tiny. This is not what I expected. It's tiny? That is a wrap. Well, I'll start weekends that over, but I'm done all the events that I have to work. And exhaustion is another word but now i'm just so happy and excited and feeling accomplished that i'm gonna like stuff my face finally explore the great city that is chicago call my mom probably beside my dad they're probably together so and just like decompress this was so fun this was everything i dreamed of Gosh. Have you ever been? 
been to heaven. This is what heaven looks like. So who's your date to the prom? Spalding. Next to my friends and their cute little feet. Hey, hey. He had me going. Hayden was like, just go down here. We made it. No, we didn't make it. We're just still not in the right spot. So the missing part of the vlog footage was he and I having a post-week dinner. Then we went to Mother Hubbard's. Who lived in the cupboard? <laughs> Air fire, please. We're trying. I don't know why I keep getting denied. Like, I've had people imposter me. It's rough out here. If you're asking why we're not at a party, it's because <laughs> there's nothing left. Ain't nothing left in the tank, man. We're done. There's nothing left in the tank. People are out with MJ smoking cigars. We gave Chicago, they out playing space. I can't. We're going to Rock Nation brunch tomorrow. Rock Nation. Beyonce? Beyonce? Okay, we're going to somebody brunch tomorrow. It's not, it's not Rock Nation. Beyonce. We're going to a non Rock Nation. And Beyonce's not here. Beyonce. But Kim is here. Oh, gosh. She didn't get Kim Kardashian is here, so. Uh -huh. Sunday service. Hallelujah. We're gonna stream it in he's the gym. Alive. He, he, he's alive. <laughs> he's alive. He, he, he's, he's alive. alive. That's all I want to hear. <laughs> okay, so this is what happens when you have a million male dancers in your lobby and the entire NBA stuff turns into a party. I wish the host had a dance together. Yes, you're in it. One, two, three, go. I missed it. Oh! I spilled a little bit. I hit start too Yeah, wait. We have entered the largest Starbucks in the country. Somehow I missed recording us actually waiting in line as if we were waiting for a bouncer to let us into a club to get into the largest Starbucks in the country. It was so worth the wait, if you ask me, because I'm a Starbucks junkie. We tried to keep the day chill. We went shopping. There was, of course, all-stars everywhere between NBA players and celebrities. It was just packed out um, and kept it chill until the game. I did have to get my drink, though. Just left this largest Starbucks in the world, the Starbucks Reserve Roastery in Chicago, and I'm drinkless. Y'all even got, you can't even buy the drinks over that drink. You can buy like the specially you wine? roasted you can buy wine, pizza? tequila, pizza, and the specially crafted roasted coffee. But I don't really like coffee. I go to Starbucks for the teas and the matchas. If you want a regular frappuccino, you can't get it up in there. So after that, we're walking to Starbucks. <laughs> the regular Starbucks. <laughs> yep. It's game time. As you can see, there, you guys know who these guys are. Yes. We went to the team store to get like some souvenirs that we can fit in our luggage. It was so crowded in there. Here's a little snippet from the game. I tried to live in the moment. You go. Chance's halftime performance 10 because he did ultra light beam. Heat, what do you give it? Anybody minding? What do you give Chance's halftime performance on a 1 to 10? 11. 11! Okay. Yeah, All the way up. Yo, did you watch it? It was amazing. If, if you didn't watch it, <laughs> slow down, go watch it, and then come back and watch the video and understand why I said 11. 11. There Actually, you, you know what? Heat. I have no words. Wait, shout out to my head, dude. Be completely honest, after the game, we partied until it was time to go to the airport the next day to go home. So many standout moments from All Star Weekend. Um, I wouldn't change a thing. It was so exciting and so great to connect with NBA workers and NBA fans and just have a great time, especially after Kobe's passing. It was just so good to be surrounded by love. I wouldn't take this moment back for anything in the world. And shout out to the Japanese media. They embrace me so much for being um, part of the Wizards family. Hope you enjoyed.